Hello everybody, it's Steve. Welcome back to Frostpunk. In the last video, we started up the arcs, and we actually have our technology, the factory, coming back as well as an extra automaton. Um, this coal pile is pretty much finished. I'm going to transfer them over to this one here in just a moment. We do have the temperature dropping to minus 40 here very soon. And taking a look at the overlay here, um, we do have a heater available for these two. But I'm actually not going to be doing much with it because I have a steam core poked out in front of these two. And then uh, our seedling arcs on their own, once the temperature drops, should go down to chili on its own. It's going to go down here in a second. Let's go ahead, turn you on for that pile. Uh, this automaton's going to like stop, go back. All right, discontent rising. Bad food. It is cold at home. Um, we've got a bunch of materials that just arrived. And we're going to send them back out. We're going to send... Wait, wait. So, remembering this, since it's a fat, since they've already been there, it should be a little faster. It's something I've learned from the comments section of the previous videos, and I do appreciate you all leaving those comments on these videos. Okay, 3015. Could just put it right there. I'm okay with that, actually. Um, these posts are pretty much done. Once the wood crates are gone, um, I do want to get a sick absence. That's fine. We got coal thumper being researched. And I'll put a coal thumper probably up close and just to let the let the automatons do their thing with it. Um, this new automaton, I'm probably going to send to the wood crates or the steel. Uh, the just going to be gone in a heartbeat. Okay, there he is. He's had a recharge. I do like the automatons. If you have to send them somewhere, they'll just walk the entire distance. They're not going to do much until, you know, they actually get there. I'm thinking probably making another hothouse and having an automaton on that, because it does take 10 workers. I also need to find... If I can find more cores, I'll be in really good shape. Let's go ahead and kick up the speed here. The automaton has reached the city. It's fully operational and ready to work. Um, let's go ahead and have it go with the wood crates. I do need to build some extra resource depots, and I could probably build them out in this area. There's also the possibility of building a sawmill here once these two are cleared out. Also, the steel works. Um, well, I do need steel to build the automatons. Let's actually do that. Wrong button. I keep hitting uh, B instead of V. So, yeah, that building will be completely crewed by automatons. And we're finishing up the coal thumper tech right now. This is going to take... Heating power upgrade, range upgrade, power upgrade, steam hub range upgrade... Bunkhouse. That's always good. Um, you know what? Let's go for drafting machines. We'll go ahead and get the automaton to clear up as much as we can, and then this will be built up. Full speed. Oh, cool. He's coming in from the, uh, I guess that's north. Another person. Sir, an engineer is asking for a day off to study an automaton closely. The automatons can be improved. They may be the pinnacle of our technology, but if we learned how to make them, we can surely learn how to make them better. If I take a closer look at any machine, I can adjust it to improve its performance. Why should we... Why should it be any different with them? Yeah! Do that, please. So, we got a guy off work here. That's totally fine. I have 47 as well. That, seem, that number seems off. So, a coal thumper. And you can put these anywhere, which is nice. So, you can put it, like, right here. And the coal thumper pot and the coal pile will be like right, right in a good spot where our folks can get to it. If that's the route I want to go. Okay, doing drafting machines here. Where's this guy going? Oh, I think he's being researched. Oh, he's going to build. Is he going to build? Where are you going? Okay, drafting machines have been researched. So we can do hothouse insulation. That's always good. Um, industrial hothouse. 
Improved heaters. That's better. Um, I need the efficiency, actually. Factory. Oh, that's already done. Let's go for more scouts so we can send out another team. You need workers. Oh, oh dear. 100 steel, 100 wood, 50 coal, and a steam core. I want to reduce that to that. I don't have enough wood, do I? Yeah. Okay. 18 hours of coal left. We do have coal being produced here. We're also not pulling a lot from here. That's understandable. And if we do drop a thumper down right there, that'll keep him busy forever. Oh, I can... I can put an automaton to use on that. Either collecting or running it. Alright, we're nine minutes away from the broken automaton. Okay, from there I want you to go... 12 hours to that. May not have been the most efficient thing to do, but... I'm um, Again, learning... We do have the temperature coming up here in a little bit, so... Okay, we also need an automaton for this building, too. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Dang it. So... We're definitely running into that limiting resource thing. One more automaton. Let's see. Definitely don't do that. Let's do that. Put you on there. And there should be a resource pile that's going to be produced infinitely for them. Let's go ahead... I'm just going to turn the cookhouse off for a bit. Put max collection on that. And as soon as I get an automaton, because they're starting to build one now, using the 100 wood that I've already collected. Oh, cool. Go ahead, I'm going to turn off those heaters. Save me a little bit of coal. And there's a coal pile out back that these guys are going to work to. Cool, we've reached the mountainside cave. A short tunnel complex leads into a vast natural cave complex. It seems there used to have been a warehouse. There may still be some supplies here. Ooh. This cave could collapse at any moment. It's no wonder it hasn't been turned into a permanent shelter. We'll take what we can and leave before we're trapped in here or worse. Ooh. Helpful. Ten hours to get there, a day and five to get there. We'll go ahead on that because it's already a known location for us. Um, yeah, I need to actually keep that up and running for a bit. Okay, we have an automaton being built. That's good. Yeah, we'll finish up with the wood crates, and then I gotta get a sawmill built. Probably right here. Wish you would tell me how much I have available. Quite a bit of wood. Wouldn't destroy as much wood here. Yeah, we'll do that. Whoops. Oh, how did I just do that? Oh! Neat, there's a little dam there. Okay, that was the view I kind of had earlier. That's the one I want to keep. So we're going to be producing coal here. And these guys are going to gather it all up based on how much... Oh, there's almost no wood left at either of these spots. That's fine. Um, yep, as soon as this automaton rolls out, we'll go ahead and put him down here. Um, did this guy actually get anything done with it?
Alright, we got more scouts. And now I want the lighter scout sleds as soon as I have the resources for it. Um, whoops. So we need the automaton integration, the steam light automaton. That's the stuff I gotta get in the next level. But I've got some stuff up here I can research just as fast. Um... Here's that wall drill, but it takes a steam core. Hot house insulation, always good. I'll do the bunkhouse research here in just a second. I think that'll be the way to go. Wall drill, coal mining, steam coal thumper. Actually, resource depot upgrade. That's going to be very helpful, I think, for us. Okay, that building's off. That's good. Wood crates have been depleted at both these sites. That's fine. Because now these guys are only going to be collecting the coal that is being produced here. There we go. And this third automaton is going to roll out of the factory here in just a moment. I'm curious what's at these two sites, but these guys have a lot of resources with them. I mean, 200 wood... Combined with the steel that I'm going to start pulling out from uh, this new automaton, it'll be helpful. Eight there, 37 there, okay. Yeah, we're going to clean up the rest of these locations, and then we're just going to start working on these deposits that we have. Yeah, sawmill being built by my lone worker. Hope rises. Okay, cool. Uh, let's go ahead and put an automaton there. Boom! Perfect! Oh, Wow! Send, employ at least two automatons in the coal industry. We got that. Uh, employ at least one automaton in the steel industry, the wood industry, and the raw food industry. I'm definitely not going to do just one of them. I almost want to double up on them if possible. Granted, we need extra steam cores for it. Let's go ahead and put none there. Sir, the automaton working on the test automaton project is back. He wants to borrow... An automaton. I'm closer to a breakthrough. I just need an automaton for a day, and I'll believe we'll be able to propose scientific modifications that will raise the performance immediately. Yeah, we'll give him one. Which one's not going to work? This one? Okay, one of them just got taken off of work. One, 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 one. Okay, this one's just moving to a safe spot, so I'm assuming he's going to be... Replaces the coal thumper. Who's my third guy? I'm hoping it's him. This ain't Sammy. I'm hoping he's, uh, this one's used. Okay, we're building up the sawmill. <clears throat> Unfortunate, because I was hoping to probably use him for that. Let's go ahead. He's not even down there. Yep, this guy's being used for it. That's fine. Okay, 30 minutes to their next location. Okay. Head to the Icefall Mine. A lot faster. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and turn you off. Resource Depot is upgraded. That's good. Um, hmm. No. Large gathering... Nope, I don't even have enough of this stuff. What? Oh, that's cool. Um, if I had the 30 wood, I would totally do that. Let's go ahead and turn off the automaton working that. Turn on the automaton working here. Shut you down. And I hope this guy shows up. Okay. I have 16 wood. Not much for me to work with, unfortunately, also because... Ugh. Extraction efficiency. Let's 
I'm just trying to find where the automaton is. Okay, he's going to the sawmill. Cool. I'm trying to figure out where he's been hiding out all dang day. Okay, it's 1100 wood available here. I'm not gonna concern myself with too, too much. Oops. Oh, storage limit has been reached. Let's go there. Um, this mine is at risk of being buried by an avalanche at any time. It's been abandoned a long time ago. Let's go ahead and pull that. Judging by the equipment, it looks like the mine was constructed before the Great Winter, possibly by the first prospectors to explore the area. The general disarray salute, inside the buildings suggests they were abandoned abruptly, presumably due to some sort of earthquake. Many valuable resources have been left behind. Whoa, that's, some, that's a good amount of coal. Um, let's go ahead and send you back to the city. You've got a ton of stuff on board, and I want to make sure we get you uh, put to good use. Um, okay, cool. We can do some things here. Hot house, hot house. I, wish, I wonder what that one does. Okay. Large resource depot. Don't have the steel for it. Don't have the steel for that. Heating. Improved heaters. Range upgrade. Yeah, let's go for the power upgrade. Okay. I'm going to do that. Do that. That. No, wait, no. None on. Here, go. Got it. So if I put an automaton on this, it's going to just complete, just continue to pull stuff for it, I think. <clears throat> also, as soon as this guy comes online, he's going to be idle for the rest of the day. We should, keyword, be able to do something with it. Okay. 204 wood, 288 steel. We're not even going to be able to build one automaton with what we're bringing back. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we can actually make something work here. Let's go minus one, plus there. The buildings that I've got turned off right now, of course, the factory, because I don't need any, and the cookhouse. Hmm. Let's take a look at the temperature. This is chilly, so we're fine on that front. It's when it goes to cold, and I'll kick the temperature up on these two, then we have to worry. But it's going to be a pretty short day where we're just going to be burning a lot more coal. Storage limit reached. Okay. Generator upgrade has been researched. Overdrive couplings, efficiency upgrade. That's the one I need. As soon as I get some extra steel. This guy should not be idle for much longer. I think he'll be uh, end of the day. We'll get him back. And oh, look, we got a ton of stuff coming into the colony right now. Boom. Actually, pretty much full on that. But let's go to the Lost Dreadnought. Send this team out. 20 hours for you. Don't need to worry about wood for the moment. In fact... Okay. So the engineer working the automaton project sent in his report. He broke the automaton he borrowed. God damn it. Now he wants a steam core. The damage hasn't been for nothing. We can fix the broken machine, and on top of what we can now adjust the automatons to make them work faster. The engineer is busy again now, but he said he's onto something, quote, really exciting. You know what? I'm okay with it. No, wait. The automatons project will end. The efficiency will rise by 5%. Wait, what? I'm, I'm kind of confused by this. So we need a steam core. He needs a steam core to fix it, but at the same time... I'm very confused by this by this uh, option here. Um, you know what? I'm going I'm to go to the wiki. Hang on. One minute, 37 seconds later. Okay. We'll give him a steam core. There's a reason for it.
Okay. This one may... Huh. Okay. We're full on trees, so let's go ahead and build a resource depot. Wait a minute. Or I could turn you off. Put you on. And turn you on. Turn you off. Where are you going, buddy? He's going to refuel. Okay. Getting more of that is a good thing. What am I researching right now? Anything I want. 10 and 50. Let's go for tier 3 because... Actually... Yeah. Damn it, wait. What am I going for here again? Let's go lighter sleds. Let's do that first. I do have an available worker. It says I have one of 48. Oh, it's an automaton that's not... Oh, you're available now? Oh, hell yeah. Get your ass down here. Come down here. Mm -hmm. Perfect. This guy's going to have an automaton in the steelworks. And I'll probably just uh, eventually go clear all of his coal piles. Okay, you're good there, you're good there, you're good there. Probably drop another hothouse down if I wanted to. I'm not really concerned about my raw food with the rations. That'll need to be kicking up. So at least I want to talk about the wood industry, one in the raw food industry. I want to get a little further in this before I rush through these objectives, because this is not a timed objective I've got. Um, this can actually be done in any order. And I'm going to step away just real quick. It's getting a little warm in my office. Okay, yeah, I just had to kick the fan on. Um, having two computers in here, plus all of this being my storage room um, for the house. I'm, my old office has been has been converted officially into a nursery for my baby. Okay. Where are the large resource depots? That's something I'm going to be looking at soon. Oh, derp. It's right there. Can't be building a place of existing one. So I could put some large depots down, maybe behind here. You're like, oh yeah, we're totally fine. Um, put on that front. Let's go ahead and kick these heaters up for both of them. Don't need to do anything with the rations. I can just kick them on, put these guys in here, and we create... Let's see. Two is for five. We're going to create... Five rations from two raw food. So 100 rations will give us 250... Uh, 100 raw food will give us 250 rations. Got it. I can math. Let's go ahead and kick this thing into gear. Alright, found a nice equilibrium here. Kind of. Got one person being treated. That's good. Do I have bunkhouses yet? Did I research them? No, I didn't. Okay. Okay. So, a lot of things I need to research. Bunkhouse is high on the list, because I want to make sure that these guys can be comfy. And of course, we're doing uh, the lighter scout sleds. That'll be researched here in the next day or so. It was actually today, it'll be done. Gotta hold on, people are depending on me. Yes, you are right, Phoebe. People are depending on us. What's going on here? Storage limit reached. Interesting. Let me go ahead and kick that up. There we go. Go ahead, turn this building on, employ some people. We'll create some meals. That's good. Hey, look at that. We're fixing that real quick. <coughs> uh, Book of Laws. Haven't needed to do a lot of things yet. We haven't had any deaths yet. We don't need the fighting arena. Um, we're, I think we're in good shape right now. Yeah, it's it's chilly today. But we'll research the bunkhouses. We'll uh, make the homes a little more habitable for folks. Let's go ahead and... 19 hours to arrive, 18 hours to arrive. Let's go for the windswept snowfield. See what's out there first. Alright. 
lighter sleds are being done, so it's not going to take nearly as long. Yeah, 12 hours. Uh, that coal pile's been depleted. That's totally fine, because there's a giant coal pile here that can be uh, harvested from. And I can put a second coal thumper down if I really want to. We don't have to go all the way out to this one if need be. Let's go ahead. Turn you on. Turn you off. Send you guys over to here. Build that. Build one automaton, please. Might as well get start building them if I need them. There is a technology... I think here that makes them much better. Did that guy ever come back with a update on his project? Oh no, no. I, I had to take a break to see what was going on. We've run out of steam cores. We know there are some in the north and south. We might see some there. We have two there. <coughs> are you bloody kidding me? Yeah, I'm gonna de I'm gonna divert them back. It says I have two. And do I have? Okay. Nope. Okay. So what? Oh damn! Oh hamburgers. So what I need to do? Oh wait a minute! No no no! I could work this. The scientific method volume one. It's got that achievement. The automaton project is complete. Automatons can now be. Produced at a lower cost and used in medical facilities. We learned to modify the automatons with precision attachments, allowing them to work the most fragile thing we know of the human body. It also turns out we can remove some non-essential parts. Well, that's great. How much did I just freaking spend? I can't cancel that one. I can! <laughs> okay, I will totally delay that. Because it's still going to produce... It's going to save me a little bit, not a lot. Um... This building's turned off. This next automaton, I think, will go to the hothouse. <clears throat> and then that way I can uh, take these engineers off, put them in, like, the sawmill. Or... Ooh, hell yeah. Okay, there's the medical automatons. Let's go generator efficiency. We absolutely need that. Burning less coal, that's a good thing. Yeah, once this automaton's finished, we'll bring him back, then we'll send him to Misty Valley, and probably run right back to the city, Mountainside Cave, South Pass. I want to get to these two things. We need those extra steam cores if possible. Do you think I need to put a steam hub over here, though? I'm just curious. I could put an automaton at the gathering post. It's producing 36, so I'm pulling 13 out. I'm figuring this out still. I'm gonna wait till it warms up a little bit. Okay, so we got another temperature drop coming. Close to the 30 minute mark right now. Let's get this last automaton out. And then, we're going straight to Misty Valley. No, we're going to the Automaton, then Misty Valley. Yeah, we need to get to Misty Valley and South Pass. We need to get some more stuff. Mm. Right, you're there. 10 hours, move it. Okay. Let's finish this one up real quick. No, it's already close to the time. It's already close to the night. Doesn't matter then. So, what we're going to do from here, uh, I'm going to put another cut in. 
next video, we're going to warm up a little bit, cool down a little bit, get cold a little bit. Um, I'll probably need to build some steam cores out there. A steam core over here would be just brilliant. In fact, let's go ahead and do that now. That's going to hopefully uh, heat this as well, but it's also going to heat up the gathering post and keep these 10 workers good for the time being. We'll put something over here. I think another sawmill is going to be needed for this. We also have some wood crate, very small amount of wood crates. They need to be broken down. We've got the side of a cliff right there. We've got the steelworks going. That's always good. We've got the sawmill with a thousand wood available. And I need to get another hothouse up and running so I can better prepare for what is coming my way. That is going to wrap it up for this video. Get that beacon out of the way. There we go. Like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and all the videos that come out on this channel. Hopefully you're okay with this new setup I've got for uh, how the channel's um, content is coming out with Frostpunk on Mondays and Wednesdays, Mars Horizons on Tuesdays and Thursdays, of course, the RTAA and Source on Fridays, and Surviving Mars, the 1040 difficulty robot colony on the weekends. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you all in the next video.